Well, there's uh, some new technologies, obviously, that have uh, influenced uh, the overall design. And uh, uh, I think one of the most important things that uh, uh, Hitachi has kept in mind with the design of the cameras is to maintain the uh, camera chain completely digital from uh, the head, from the camera head, all the way out to the CCU. And uh, one of the most impacts that we've had, and uh, as far as technology is concerned, is our digital triax system, which uh, is now deliverable. And uh, it's a triax system that's actually been around since 1994, except that now we're doing it with high def. And uh, Hitachi uh, triax system differs in that we use uh, time division multiplex, which is completely digital. Uh, from the beginning, we've always touted that uh, fiber optics was the most cleanest and uh, best way to convey a completely digital signal from the camera head down to the CCU. And a lot of, I would say 80% of our customers still think so. So I would say 80% of our cameras are still being sold or are sold with uh, uh, fiber optic, digital fiber optic. We're one of uh, the world leaders in digital processing technology. We have thousands of patents in digital processing. And uh, our cameras are, uh, as far as technology is concerned, second to none as far as technology and advancement. So Hitachi is ready to do 3D, 1080p, slow motion, fast motion. If you were to uh, look into detail about what impacts Hitachi uh, has had in the industry, they are plentiful. And uh, I'm sure well, there will be a player in uh, this industry and any technology that comes or that's needed in the industry for years to come. Tapeless acquisition um, right now is uh, a major driving force because uh, a lot of the productions are being done in the field and uh, tape is going away. Um, it's really a, a dollars and cents kind of thing uh, that simplifies the production workflow, although Hitachi uh, right now has adopted the P2 standard. Uh, we don't much uh, cater to uh, camcorders or to the manufacture of camcorders because we've emphasized always uh, studio and field production cameras for high-end and studio production. Two-thirds inch has not only better sensitivity and resolution, but the widest choice of lenses, uh, better performance as far as the lenses themselves are concerned, uh, depth of field characteristics, uh, modulation transfer curves, resolution, all these things are uh, fundamental qualities that you would want to maximize in your production. Uh, everybody's uh, wanting to have one piece of equipment that does as much as possible. So uh, maximum flexibility in configuration is a very desirable thing. Uh, our high definition cameras are designed as two piece just for that fact, for the fact that you have a camera head that's able to be separated from the back end and that allows you to uh, basically put on a recorder in the back, you could put a fiber back on it, you could put a digital triax back on it, you could put a wireless back on it. The support equipment is lighter, the physical space needed to transport all this equipment is less, so OB trucks or field production trucks now have a weight savings, a space savings, and an equipment cost savings. All these things add up in the long run, and to be able to make a better production with less uh, equipment and less money and less expense up front is what we all want. So.